Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Hearts of Iron 4. We left off last time, in pr last time planning our Barbarossa, which right now is basically a pocket of Kiev and a general push towards Moscow. Um, looks like the force composition's pretty good. Uh, it won't actually show me what's there because the border is with an ally, not with myself, actually, and that was a C plan, so... Hmm. 40. We could upgrade our, our Hinkles to Junkers. Let's see here. Service manpower 40. Operational range 2k. Air defense, though, this, that's a little higher. Air attack is higher. Strategic bombing's higher. Agility is higher. Ground attack is higher. Speed is a little bit higher. So I think it's going to be worth it. Yeah, we could get that going. Start replacing our Hinkles. Hinkles? Hinkles? We're kind of waiting on production right now. We are producing a lot of stuff. But. But we need more. We could always use more. Japan declared war on the Netherlands. That's fine with me. Let's see. Mutually exclusive with alliance with the USSR effects. Gains annex war goals against the Soviet Union. We'll get that war goal. I believe that should be a permanent one. I don't think it'll go away like the, the ones we just make up. We should probably take out... Be we could probably take out Belgium. Do they have any resources that would be useful? Well, they got steel. They got a lot of steel in here. And we... we I forgot... We left Luxembourg alone, didn't we? Well, maybe when we will we'll wait for some of these guys to deploy. I don't want to take anybody off of the Soviet frontier right now. I feel like that would be not a great idea. Two convoys lost, two convoys lost. Yep. Still sinking them. I don't get why these guys are just sitting here. Let's have them move over here. Oh. They're not. Alright, um, there you go. Just, just... Atlantic it up, fall of Hong Kong, cool. Alrighty, nice. Belgium and Luxembourg probably should fall. Uh, I feel like at any point they could ally themselves with the Allies and cause a problem for me. So those are... Uh, artillery I'm not too concerned with because those are upgrades... We need more of these. There we go. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Are we just are those being repaired or freshly built? Freshly built it looks like. Oh, we got more oil, uh synthetic oil plants coming, that's good. Called Poland in, okay. Lots of fighters. And we're we're getting new one on one nineties in the air too. I mean, those 109Bs are pretty damn good, so I don't really feel like there's necessarily a need to take them off the production queue right now. Can you give, uh, can you give war goals like you used to be able to? Like, tell someone I want, to, want them to go over there? I don't think so. Now, what, what, I'm, what I'm thinking here right now is, when I take these lands, are they going to go to Romania and Poland, or are they going to go to me? I think they're going to go to Romania and Poland. Which is going to be weird. I wish I could have taken Romania myself. No. No. 
can't kick him out of the faction and take him after the, after the fact, I don't think, either. And that is air experience. I'm wondering why... Let's see, which one is this? Like, like this was really good. The Soviets must be moving troops around. I just can't, can't freaking see what they are. Not for the life of me, I can't see what they are. There are 90 X... <laughs> I gotta say, I've, I've only got 50... 63 divisions here. Poland's got 90, so... There are a lot of Poles there who will be helping. There's also Hungarians, Romanians, Estonians. I think they're all they're all just gl glumped up there under the Romanian flag. Maybe all of these Poli Polish, quote-unquote Polish divisions are clumped up. Uh, well, everybody else is clumped up over there. Medium panzers are going to come off the queue soon. Uh, oh, looks like we deployed the heavy panzers. So those are going to go to Rommel, uh, who is right here. Get them over there. I might be giving them... I, I, I might, might, might be giving these guys too much territory per army. Like this one? It's telling me there's no rush. Basically, no, no opposition there. Basically, no opposition here. But Rommel, the guy with my, my heavy tanks and all my panzers, he's got a hell of a, a fight ahead of him It's telling me. Well, you know... How many... 74 Tigers, which are cool. But 126 Gross Tractors. Series of prototypes to develop heavy tanks for Germany after the First World War. Germany has restricted on military development by the Versailles Treaty. A secret program under the name Tractor was developed to armored vehicles for artillery. Okay, that's fine. Well, they're there. They're not very good, but they're there. All right. So the heavy tanks popped off. That's good. Uh, how's the next heavy? Well, the never next heavy panzers are almost ready. A medium panzers. Uh, medium tank destroyer support. Uh, heavy tanks, they've got 14 ti 16 Tigers of the required 200. So that, that's funny. They've got 85% of the equipment. But none of the Tigers. Oh, air upgrades. We need to start cranking on heavy tanks, I think. Improve anti-tank guns, or do we want to improve our artillery first? Because that's just straight up, everything will get 10% better. Let's get that first. Logistics company, those will get added in everybody. Ooh, we're about to pop off 10 new infantry divisions. That's great. And more, uh, more what's called tigers. Not tigers, um, medium tanks. Um, let's drop that down and let's bring the tigers up. That'd be that right there. I really, oh, nope, that was the wrong one. Chromium, we're low on chromium. One and a half per day. But we're, we, I, I feel like we should have some chromium. God, are they are they really not capable? Where's resistance? Missed it. Oh wow. Uh, we need more MPs. And I actually think um, I'm going to reduce the size now because we have the better uh, we have the the better MP divisions. I think it should have automatically increased them to like level two. So we're not going to remove them. Um, oops. Edit. Let's make these smaller now. And we got see, military police, recon company. Everything else is fine. So there's pressure of 20. I kind of, I, what I really wish is that like when you hover it over or maybe next to it, it would show you uh, what was the increase or decrease versus what it was before you changed it. <sighs> Can't start knocking stuff off my desk. Train. Alright, uh, we are going to put them here. I guess we'll just keep them going. I'm missing equipment production for light tanks. Is that a big deal? 
We're not... We do have light tanks in the army right now. But we're not building any light tanks. Hmm. Two per day. 4.5 per day. Oh, uh, that's the two medium panzers. Uh, where's the last one? He's almost there. 92% trained. Come on, come on. Uh, there we go. Now it's... Now it says everybody's fine. Everybody's got great plans now. So why don't we... Uh, call this the... First... Panzer... Army. First Panzer Army. And... What we're gonna do is we're find our heavy panzers. Oh, first Panzer Army plus plus. Uh, first heavy panzers, and we're gonna call these. Um, hmm, who do we want to name them after? Sorry about those interruptions. My phone keeps going off. All right, so right now it's 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 telling me everybody but this guy is good. I mean, these guys have all their equipment. Organization 49, current manpower, supply, hours to spare. Okay, they're all fine. Yeah, they got everything they needed. Still short 1,500 anti-tank guns, which I feel like is a bad thing. How, what are we building anti-tank guns at a rate of? So, yes, that's we're actually good on fighters now. Uh, why, why don't we start switching switching these over to um, 190s? Anti-tank guns, 1,500, yeah. I don't like that. I don't like that we're that low on... So you are... Does that mean he's out and about, the little thingy? Who are you? Or what are you doing? You're on patrol? Convoy rating. Maybe that's why he's not doing anything. He's on he's on patrol. Jesus. Uh, cruisers, submarines. Uh, these are. They they there. God damn it. They're in the mid Atlantic. All right. How do I take one of these off and I just reset it like that? Oh, God. All right, that seems like a design flaw. Can I just right-click and take it off once I put it on there? Okay, there's that. All right, so, and right over here should be all of my... Naval map mode is, like, broken. Not broken. I don't like it, though. Let's mer... Come on. Heavy cruisers. We got a lot of heavy cruisers. We built a bunch of them. They're good surface raiders. And does that leave anybody else out? There's more heavy cruisers in southern France equipped to... What? 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 How did those guys get over there? Were they built there? Admiral Hipper. I don't feel like those were ones that were built there. That's weird. Uh, we're... War with the USSR. Okay, that's that's something I can do now. Befriend Turkey. Uh, alliance, requires the following alliance with Italy. Where's alliance with Italy? Is it something that I can't do anymore? I'm lost. Lines with Italy. Requires second Vienna award. A friend check of the fate of Czechoslovakia. At peace with Czechoslovakia. Not a faction. Okay, so I can't do any of that. Although, I mean, I, I am... Aren't I already... I remember my faction, right? 
Well, that's a little funky. I feel like I should be able to do that, because we are... We do have an alliance, right? They're a member of my faction. Yeah. Hmm. Oh well, does that mean we're basically out of focuses? I don't really... Well, we do wonder weapons. We can do around the Maginot. <laughs> Alright. Yes, I know we're not building light tanks, but we're basically replacing them with medium tanks. Italian-German Technology Treaty. Excellent suggestion. Mountain Infantry 2, Naval Doctrine. Sure. Sure, we can do that. Alright, are these... Okay, those are some new tanks. Um, last one that's going to Rommel. Whoops, that was wrong. I should have just done it like this. And then, there. There should be ten new divisions here. There they are. Uh, you are going to get a new army. Under General... Manstein? No, this is just infantry. Trickster and armored... armored well, uh, well, let's go by skill level. At you. Alright, and you're gonna get a section of front. Right up there. I don't feel like there's a lot of Soviet troops up here. You're gonna go from here through Rzhev, basically. I like that. Uh, these are pretty basic plans, because I've never done... Um, I, I, I did play a lot off-screen, off, off screen, but I was bouncing around between nations. I never really got too far into the war, so this is not something I've really done before in the invasion of the Soviet Union. I don't know how many of these troops we're actually going to circle and destroy. Medium tanks. Infantry equipment, yeah, keep that up. Logistics company. Nice. That's gonna be useful. Uh, maintenance company reliability. We can do MP3s if we want. Do increased... Every Basically, we get everything better. What does the signal company do? Always your specialized with new communication detection, technology in the Great War. New huh, practice head. Manpower supply use, production, training time, initiative 5%. Okay. And field hospital is experience loss minus 20 back, 20%, trickle back 20%. Um, logistics company, is it, it's, it's supply usage. Okay, yeah. Recon company is reconnaissance. Engineer company, everybody's got engineers. So let's get that up. Uh, we're going to go to our division planner here. Uh, the medium tank divisions are going to get a logistics company. Save that. The heavy tank divisions, edit pans, uh, we're gonna get a logistics company. Save that. And we have free military factories. Uh, I feel like we should definitely do this. <laughs> Start cranking on those Panzer threes. Well, it actually showed me if I go my army, equipment, anti-air artillery, infantry, military, heavy tank, 400. So we've, oh, we've got a standing military of... Uh, we're sh we should have 400 Tigers in in the field. We don't, but we should. Medium uh, Light tanks, 3,000. Medium tanks, 2,000. Italy declares war on Greece. That's fine with me. As long as you win, you bastards. I feel like Italy should declare war on Turkey. Yeah, like these, these numbers, they keep fluctuating pretty wildly. One, uh, one, one moment I'm fine, the next I'm not. I was trying to watch the, uh, the plans here as they, as it shows them.
That's not bad. Well, it doesn't really... Doesn't really do exactly what I wanted. Hmm. Lost two convoys. Lost two convoys. Lost two convoys. Where's my surface fleet again? It should be right here, right? Submarines, submarines, surface fleet. Wait, aren't you out on mission? Yeah, you, ah. I guess what I'm not liking is that they still show up in the fleet even when they're not in the fleet. Or uh, in the fleet when they're out and about. Select. Uh, let's put him on convoy rating. My surface ship's here. Get him out and about. See if they'll do any good. And didn't I bring a bunch of ships in over here? 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 There's a bunch of them somewhere. 21 ships in this fleet. Ch it looks like they're chasing down those Spanish troops that are on the move. Fighters, what are you made up of? 393 BF-109Bs and 7 Focal 490s. That's okay. Hmm. I'm not entirely sure. I, I'm trusting the... the little bar down here. 10 units and is capable of efficiently leading 24. Uh, force comparison is strong units and along the border. And, in, and defense is ahead in the advancement direction, if there are any. I don't know if I believe that. I mean, it, it's fluctuating all over the place, and the Soviet defenses should be extremely weak versus crack German troops right now. Double war goals is... I actually have war goals versus Yugoslavia, but I can't use them. You have a non-aggression pact with them. When does that end? Well, we could boost party popularity here if we want to. And stage a coup if we wanted to. A fascist coup. In Leningrad. Just for shits and giggles. So I can't declare war. I have... Is this the... The growth of... Military ashes to other nations. Non-aggression pact. Oh, here it is. How do I get rid of that? It just says there's a non-aggression pact. Cancel non-aggression pact. I uh, cannot revoke pact before the 31st of May. Oh, okay. Just a few months. And, and it depends on how many divisions are on the front, it looks like. How are we doing here on recruitment? Ooh, SS divisions are just about done. Uh, MPs are on their way. Infantry is coming. Heavy tanks are coming. Medium tanks are coming. We're just build building them up. Looks like they. It looks like basically what happened. Well, this guy is mostly tiger. 115 tigers in here. What are we building those? Are we? I hope the production rate lines are up to snuff on those. Well, probably the first thing using chromium. Yeah, they're the only ones using the production of heavy armor. Uh, where do they go? Where do they go? Where do they go? Two per day. And we're not at our we're not at our eighty percent production cap yet, and we're losing five point four percent due to lack of resources. So, if we want to, we can go chromium, Italy. Send and get that done. Okay, we're gonna leave this episode right here. If you have enjoyed it, please just drop me a like, leave me those comments right down below. If you are interested in more Benjamin Magnus plays Hearts of Iron 4, just subscribe to this channel and I will see you next time.